Alright, so did you know there's an easy way to make some money in Bully? And yes, I've been playing Bully and I've actually found out a really easy way to make some money. And it's really easy to do it, so... And it's really simple as well, so I'm going to show you how you can make a ton of money. And you can do this for however long as you want. So let's get into the video. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to complete the first chapter. Because chapter 2 is going to have you move out of um, the Bullworth Academy so you can run wherever you want and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make your way to this location over here which I will put an put, um, arrow next to it so you know where where I'm pointing at since there's no waypoint so you want to go to this location here so I will see you there okay so here we are so and the reason why I want to come here is we want to pick up this bat so pick up your bat and then, then, then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make your way to the fun fair, which is this location here on the map, So, which is just down the road, so I'll see you there. And also, just a quick um, tip as I'm, as I'm going there, is that you want to do this after you've done your two classes, but... Because um, <clears throat> um, what's going to happen is if you go off-site during the um, school times, you will get... Um, dragged by the police and you will have a hard time getting to the fun fair. So you want to do this after you've done your two classes. Okay, so here we are at the um, Carnival Fun Fair. So so then you're going to want to pay for your ticket. So pay for your ticket. Then pick up your bat. Go through the gate. And this is where you want to go. Now it it's always laggy around here for me, but either way I'll show you where you want to go. So you want to follow where I want to go. So you want to go here and then see where this fun fair ride is you want to go down here then you want to go to your right and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to this hidden room so go in this hidden room with your baseball bat and um, okay and this is where you want to go next and then round here you see this icon this is where the money begins so this wrestling fight so it is what you want to do you all i always recommend that you bet your money on the tattooed wrestler the reason why is because um, he will win most of the fights so you want to bet all your money on the tattooed wrestler or basically the wrestler on the right so the one with tattoos and the mask on bet all your money on this one then then all you want to do then is you just want to watch the fight. Now this feels good. Then then here's what you want to do. See that? Now you see what I'm doing? Just like that. And this is why we've got the bat. Cause what's gonna happen is you can actually get a good advantage on the wrestler. So, and then you can just keep doing this over and over again, so... Unfortunately though, your baseball bat will break. But if it does break, then you can still watch the fight. But the baseball bat makes it even more better. But sometimes you won't go to war, but you're just going to have to get really lucky to make sure that the wrestler goes towards you. Well, just... So pretty much you just do this over and over again. Now sometimes he won't win the fights, but I will sh show you what happens if you ever come to a point where you might be losing. See? Now if you feel like he's about to lose, run away and you will get your money back. So I always recommend to run away if your wrestler gets knocked on the floor twice or once, but or if you just feel like that you're going to lose, then just run away and come back so pretty much that's simple so I'm gonna show you again <clears throat> so bet all your money then watch the fight if you feel like you're about to lose then just walk run away and you can get your money back and if you're and if the, your opponent is clearly um, close to you then use your baseball bat on him and as you can see Just like that, really easy. So pretty much you're getting double the money back. And you can do this pretty much over and over again, so 
I would recommend to stop um, betting your money when it gets to like 10 o'clock because um, what? Because obviously Jimmy will pass out at 2 a.m. So once it gets to 10 o'clock, then I would recommend that you would go and save your game and then you wait till um, you've done your classes and go back again. So, anyways, oh, that's going to be it for this quick guide. So thank you a lot for watching, and I shall see you lot in the next one. Take care, everyone.